One time, this guy called me ugly, so I punched him in the face. What do you need? Yes, and you are? Ah, good to meet you. Thank you. The only thing I want is to see Skyrim again. I miss being able to see what I eat, and love seeing the faces of my enemies as they scream in terror. Bashing a head in is so much more satisfying when you can see it. Anyway, that's not important. What's important is an alchemist named Maria. She claims to have brewed a potion capable of curing my blindness. However, she says I have to marry her before she'll give it to me. I don't want to marry her. So you see, we have ourselves a dilemma. That's where you come in. Start by talking to Maria. She tends to hang around the western side of Dead Man's Drink. Help her out a little bit. You'll find a way to get the location of the bottle. Once you've located the bottle, I'll need you to grab it. Bring it back here so I can drink it and finally free myself from this wretched curse. Help me out, and the Thieves' Guild receives my full support. I've made many contacts over the years. One of the first songs I ever learned. Any questions? Ragnar the Red. Oh, there once was a hero Believe me, I've considered that, but only as a last resort. Maria's crazy. She would be extremely upset and even more insane than she already is. She would most likely attempt to kill me, or possibly herself. Either way, it wouldn't end well. Take care. I used to be an adventurer like you, but then I got drunk and lost everything. Why, yes, as anyone with eyesight could tell, I'm not in the greatest of shape. There are two things I could use some help with. First, I could use some spare septims. Second, there are several great beasts that need to be killed. But I will explain that later. I was thinking ten... thousand septims. Oh, but I am serious, and don't call me Shirley. Uh, okay, you got me. I'm not serious. I only need a thousand septums. Well then, prepare to get fisted! Make it snappy. You got my money? Excellent. We can now deal with the beasts that threaten us. Return to me when you're ready. Fine, it's a deal. Good. Now we can move on to the beast problem. Return to me when you're ready. All right, picture this. These are massive creatures. They have horns and heads larger than your entire body. Teeth larger, sharper, and stronger than a dragon's. And they are very, very ugly. Sadly, no. What I told you is all I know. These are the descriptions recovered from the journals of dead warriors who failed to kill the creatures. I don't know how long we have, but it's vital that you leave at once to destroy the beasts. They are located at Peak's Shade Catacombs, east of Falkreet. Return to me once they are dead. What? What is the meaning of this? My family has been murdered! MURDERED! You will pay for this! We goats have been oppressed for far too long! There will be an uprising! 
You'll see! You will all see! What? You're sure? The journal said they were much more terrifying and deadly. Uh, feel both relieved and worried. Did you come across anything strange in the catacombs? Well, actually, no, I haven't. A couple of warriors wandered into Dead Man's Drink a while back, yammering to everyone about the beast. They were holding out journals, claiming the books belonged to their fallen brethren. The warriors, however, didn't let anyone read the books. I happened to be drunk myself during their arrival. Tend to be more gullible then. But I digress. Did you find anything else worth mentioning? Okay, now you're just making fun of me. <laughs> I mean, I can believe the beasts turning out to be goats. But a talking goat who plans to start an uprising? You expect me to believe such insanity? What's next? Are you going to tell me you helped out a talking dog? Uh, regardless. Thank you for clearing out the cavern. Speak to Maria. She will be happy to hear this. What do you need? You found it! <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Wait. What about Maria? Damn. I knew this was going to happen. She was always too stubborn and crazy for her own good. I'm sure you did your best. Is there anything else you wanted to tell me? What? Let me see that journal. Unbelievable. That stupid bitch! This explains everything. Here, take this back. I don't want to see it again. I'm not sure how I should feel about this. On the one hand, I was hoping Maria wouldn't be killed. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad she's dead. Ah, and the important thing is you brought the bottle back. That's all I care about right now. Now, for the moment of truth. Ah, I feel strange. I'll lie down and get some rest. Why don't you come back in a day? It'll give me time to get everything organized. I can see again! I've never been happier in my entire life! Thank you, friend. I couldn't have done this without you. My contacts have come through, and as such, the Thieves' Guild will receive my full support. I will also buy any merchandise that you have. If you ever need an extra hand, feel free to drop by and ask. Ah, I, I would be honored to join you. I really do. To the next fight. What do you need? Fine by me. Farewell. To the next fight. All right, what do you need? Let's move. The storm cloaks and restore what we what is it? With our blood and Go on ahead. Steel, I'll stand guard. Let's crack some skulls. Down. Yeah! Call that a hit! Ah, like the bite of a hawk! 